Hello and welcome to December 12th. Today I'm going to show you a great trick on how to solder to the diodes you remove from your HD DVD drives and the DVD burners. So first you want to take just any normal wire and strip it down. Next we want to twist it up nice and tight so it looks like this, so it's all perfect and together. Then we'll take a pair of needle nose pliers and you want to wrap it round the one side, just enough to form a loop. You can do this with your fingers, but you get a much more precise loop if you use a pair of pliers. So you want to take the loop and just make it a little bit smaller. Next, take your soldering iron and some solder and cover the loop in solder, so there's no hole anymore. So you end up with something looking like this. Note there is a little bit of excess on the outside where the end of the loop was. You want to take some wire cutters and just remove that. This is just to avoid shorting out the laser diode. Next, you need to work out the pinout of your diodes. So I've put the red on the left and the blue from the HD DVD drive on the right. This is a red diode from a DVD burner. And what you want to do is place the, where the loop was over the pin. Take your soldering iron, be careful not to burn your fingers, and slowly press down just over that. Note I've got the diode already in the axis housing. This is great as it works as a heatsink, meaning you're far less likely to damage your diode while soldering to it. So take the rest of the axis housing and put it together and you have your red diode inside the axis housing all soldered up. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe. One video every day in December. 